The Surface Studio is truly a remarkable device. So recently I was with my kids at the local mall and they had a Microsoft store and of course they had a Surface Studio on display and I couldn't resist getting a closer look and trying it out for myself. And I was actually blown away at how massive and beautiful the Surface Studio screen is. So a few big takeaways for me is that the screen is so immersive and so big that I don't actually want to use the mouse with it. I want to use the dial, I want to use the pen, I want to kind of get right in there, not use it as a monitor, but as a big gigantic tablet screen. Uh, the other interesting thing is that the dial itself, when the screen is vertical, kind of slides down a little bit. Uh, so you definitely want to have the screen all the way down when you use it. Uh, but really, what I was amazed is how much my kids loved playing with the Surface Studio. So you can see them here just being mesmerized by this super high definition screen. There were a few times that I completely forgot I was working on a computer and I was just kind of sucked in and drawn in and it just felt like this gigantic gigantic canvas. You can see my daughter here drawing a little tiny picture at the very bottom corner of the screen. She's got so much real estate to work with. The other thing I was really surprised about is I thought that the Surface Studio was actually bolted into the countertop uh, but when I actually lifted up and down the screen I twisted and I realized no it's just that the Surface Studio itself was the base is really heavy so that you can actually lift the screen up and put it down all the way. So the Surface Studio is obviously not priced for kids <laughs> but I think that you know having kids play with technology is a great way to see if that technology is truly awe-inspiring, it's truly fun, uh, truly entertaining and the Surface Studio definitely passed all the marks. So there you go just a quick little hands-on video with me and my kids. Uh, I really hope you enjoyed this video if you did uh, please hit the like button. Thank you very much for watching. By the way, special shout out to a guy named Paul Het. Funny story, so I was going to FedEx recently to go pick up a package and I walked through the door and there was a guy standing near the front and he said, hey, are you Sean Ong? And I thought it was uh, one of the FedEx employees who recognized me somehow, I didn't know. So I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm Sean Ong here to pick up my package. He's like, oh, uh, I'm your fan on YouTube. <laughs> I was like, oh, that's unexpected. So pretty fun, we had a fun little conversation uh, and I told him that yeah you know I hadn't been putting out any videos but because of you Paul I will start to put out a lot more videos so uh, you can blame Paul for the recent uh, uptick in videos that I've been posting and expect to see a lot more I've got several queued up over the next few days uh, so again just a special shout out to Paul Het. <laughs>